Hello everybody, how are you going? So in this video, I want to give you an overview of the changes that we've decided to make to this unit so that even though the majority of it is delivered online, it's still going to be satisfying, rewarding and give you a really interesting insight into the introduction to acting. We are living in amazing times, extraordinary times. Uh, it's stressful, it's perturbing, discombobulating. And the first thing I want to say is that we are here for you and we understand. Now, I realize that some of you didn't get the messages that I've been sending via the Moodle site. That's a real shame and I apologize for the technical glitch there. I don't know what happened. But I am concerned that you've spent a few days thinking that we weren't in contact with you and potentially that we didn't care. Well, that's not the case. We do care. We are here for you. And it is really crucial that in this very peculiar time, you don't feel that you're alone because you're not. One of the emails I sent round, one of the announcements, was to tell you about the new student-run CTP Facebook page. So uh, there are details of that. There's the link both on the website, uh, the Moodle website, but also in one of the emails that I sent you. Please do join up to that because there you'll find the community of CTP students who are there just for you, who feel the same as you, who are uh, as, as perturbed and discombobulated and... I don't know, sort of lonely as you guys are, because we're well aware that you've come to university with so many expectations, so many hopes, and it seems, or it must seem to you, that all of those have been dashed right now. Well, that's not the case. We can still have a great time. You can still feel engaged online, and we are here to try to facilitate that. So, going on to this unit. Well, Laura and I have spent a lot of time brainstorming and we are very confident that we can give you a great experience. If you'd asked me a week ago, can you teach acting online? I would have said, no, of course you can't. It's a contact sport. Well, since thinking that, I have been re-educated. We're lucky that Laura has actually done several courses online and so she understands what it's like from a student perspective, but she's also taught online as well, so you have the best of both worlds with her. We've also been looking at lots of different pedagogies, lots of different methodologies that other people have used, and we've come up with this. Each week, until I take over round about week six, week seven, Laura will do a combination of lecture videos, which she will do herself. And she's also going to contact you in small groups so that you can have one-to-one -one sessions, uh, if you like, a, a, a webinar in real time during your class times. So during those, Laura will have a chance to talk to you in groups of five or six to discuss in detail some of the learning tasks for each week. And that will give you the opportunity to do some practical stuff as well. Now, obviously, with a video and online format, what's going to happen is that you'll develop pot potentially more skills at um, screen acting, at film acting, than on stage. Well, that's okay. That's absolutely fine. In fact, that might be exactly what you wanted. An awful lot of the job um, the attempts to get jobs that actors have to do. An awful lot of screen auditions are done on uh, what are known as self-tapes, which is basically like this, me talking into the camera on a laptop or on a phone. So in a strange way, there is actually an advantage to teaching online because you will develop skills in this new technique of uh, self-taping, which to you know, an old codger like me, somebody who's been in the business for 30 years, all seems a little bit strange, I have to say. I quite like walking into audition rooms and seeing people. But Laura is well on top of that, so she's going to contact you and talk you through the precise details of how each week is going to run, when you should sign up to the web webinars, when you need to be available for face-to-face, real-time contact. And then I'm going to come on board and I'm going to have a couple of weeks with you teaching you about Shakespeare. This is not something to be apprehensive about. You might hate Shakespeare. You might think it's too difficult for you. Well, if that's the case, that's fine. But as an actor, I know that if you can crack Shakespearean verse speaking, you can do anything. So the couple of weeks I'll spend with you will be the same format as with Laura. I'll do a, a, a lecture on Shakespeare and then we'll have webinars in real time where I'll get to talk to you and work with you in real time on your Shakespearean monologues. Now, today, I just had notification from the university that they are going to allow us to deliver this unit in a split format. 
So that means that there will be an online component and that will take in your assessments one and two. So that's your character piece. And that's also um, your monologues. I'll talk about that in, in later. We'll, uh, I'll talk about that in detail later in a different video. But as you know, one of the crucial things about acting is community, collaboration, working in a room with somebody else. And the great success of this unit has always been that we've put you actors together with the third year directors to work on a scene. Well, the university has given us approval that we can actually do that as an intensive in semester two at a time to be arranged depending on the crisis situation. So that means that you will have an intensive period of six to eight hours sometime in semester two where you will work on scenes with your directors. We will have a full showing of that and you will have the experience of real time in live person, face to face, contactful, in the room together, rehearsal. That will be overseen by me and by Laura. So I'm really delighted that what is the best and most uh, exciting element of assessment in this unit is still going ahead. It's just it's happening later. In terms of your grades, don't worry about that. All that will happen is that we will put into your grades for the exam period from semester one a WH. That means withheld and that means that your grades will just carry over until they're finalised in semester two. So there is nothing to worry about there. So that's all I wanted to say about today. Basically, we are very confident that we can give you a good experience on, on, online. If for any reason you have problems or concerns or you don't think this is working for you, please contact me. It's our priority to make your units as good as they can possibly be in the given circumstances. There will be some technical glitches. I'm fully aware of that. We're having all sorts of rumours about the internet going down because of high volume. Well, look, I don't think that's going to happen. But if you have difficulty signing on to Zoom or getting internet connection or anything like that, then just let us know. We can always work around things. Also, I want you to know that you can contact us if you are feeling lonely or afraid or concerned or any of those things, because this is a huge thing that is happening to us all and a very, very big thing that's happening to you in your first semester at university. So we are here for you. Don't forget too the community of other CTP students. You'll find them on the various Facebook pages. And finally, just to say, I hope that you can find some enjoyment in all of this, in all this crazy time. The important thing is that you look after yourself and each other. And hopefully this unit will give you a chance to have a little bit of self-care. Even something as simple as doing a tongue twister or learning how to breathe properly is doing something good for you. So enjoy yourself. Don't forget to contact us if you have any problems. We are here for you. Bye bye.